Kids, I will not let them have I will back them up. I got to be back. And I'm asking everybody here to beat you. Don't forget, when we get beat you up and running, and everybody say they don't like coming to beat you, right? When you come across the cop in the road, you're going to pay a toll. <laughs> we going to rebuild our roads one way or another. But you won't be coming through here talking about you don't like this community. You'll help us pay to get your roads fixed. You'll help us build these buildings. Howard Croft is in the house. Where's Howard? We're building our solar city right here in Beecher. That's never been done. We're leaving to go to Old Toe, Japan. Where's Howard at? Stand up, house, so I can see you. We got a genius right there. Imagine all of our buildings down here in Beecher. Everything is solar, guys. We got it. Howard Cross is going to make it work for us. We got the workforce. Now the kids are working. They're building the stuff. We're talking about employing our own folks. So it's going to happen, y'all. So I just want y'all to bear along with us. We need your help. Beat your wing down and out. We're going to talk to the governor. And you know what the governor said? And my friend Steve Wilson sitting right there now with my foundation. It ain't for him. I ain't got it dime. <laughs> Bottom line. Rick Snyder said, what can we do to help y'all? I've never been to Beecher, and I don't plan on going to Beecher. But you tell me what you need. He is the governor. He said, I will take care of that area too, but nobody has came to him and asked him to do it. And he, they'll do it, Republican, whatever that stuff means. I'm a Republican on some things, I'm a Democrat on others. <laughs> and I'll mix it up in the middle if I have to. But I'm saying, guys, Rick Snyder runs this deal. We got to get him to come down to the beach and we can't alienate him. He's going to help us. We're going to change the beach. And I'm telling you guys, we're sitting on the gold mine. And I, every night I go to bed, that's all I think about. My goodness. How do we have a city like this, all this vacant stuff? Where's the police chief at? Where's my police chief at? Stand up, man. Got a police chief up in there and shoot you and mess with me. <laughs> mess with me. I'll get the police chief. Put Larry Green in it. Supervisor. Put Larry. There he is over there. Supervisor. Tell him. somebody in it because I want to, but I'm just saying, Charles, y'all standing right there. Get y'all, he, he the one that made this wall work. Y'all don't leave. <laughs> don't leave. I'm going to tell you, when you get two bucks in a community, you get some bucking going. And me and Charles got bucking going, and we done settled the bucket. We together. Charles, we together. In the store. In the store. Y'all we gonna change and help me out. Thank you, Jackie. Let's give a nice round of applause. I'll do one more thing for Frank White. I've been knowing Frank White. He's the only person I've been knowing 50 years. I had to say that. I've been knowing Frank for 50 years. We went down to Frank's Good evening, everyone. On behalf of Youth Karateka Association, we want to thank you for being here this evening. Uh, we will be getting started with the dinner, and uh, Holly will be um, sharing how uh, we would like for you to um, move forward through the banquet line. Um, again, we want to thank all of you. As you can see, we do have a silent auction which is right up front, and uh, feel free to mingle up there and see what's uh, available for you uh, to bid on. Uh, we have wonderful donations from a lot of stores throughout uh, Genesee County and lots of good deals for you. Uh, in addition, we are kicking off our Friends of Youth Karateka 
uh, or association group. And we'd like all of you to become a friend of ours. And what we would expect for the friends is to participate in events like this and to uh, support us as we move forward in helping to change the lives of young people. So uh, I won't take up any more time at this point. We'll have Holly come forward and get started with the banquet. where all of your food has come from, all of the local sources we obtained food from for your meal this evening. And what we're going to do is eat. You can get up and go to the silent auction during dinner. When dinner closes, we're going to watch Kings of Flint on this screen right here. And if you can't see from where you're sitting, feel free to move your chair. And get up and, and um, you know, until, until he announces something's closed on silent auction. But, Oh, 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 that screen, sorry, we'll change, okay. Uh, that screen in the back, the little one. Um, and feel free, you can get up and bid until it's announced that the silent auction is closing. And no, you can't have dessert first. I've already been asked. Um, also, I want you to know that we are going to wash and reuse the plastic plates and the plastic spoons and forks not the cups, so I'm going to pull a white big cooler out here and there'll be a sign that says your plastic cups or your plastic forks, spoons and plates can go in there and the other stuff can go in the trash. So we'll have, hopefully if you get mixed up, just ask and we'll, we'll give you a hand. And before we get, we're going to call tables, so we'll call tomatoes or carrots or asparagus or lettuce, but um, We've got lettuce at both ends and asparagus at both ends, so I'll kind of point to you. Um, and before we start to do that, I would like to introduce my good friend, Claire Mater, who will do a blessing this evening. So it's important to arrive and to come into your body in a time like this. We go outward and we see so many faces of people we know. And that's one way to take in community and communion. I also want to invite you to go inward and realize that every cell in your body will be nourished by this food. And it's an opportunity for us to claim what we value. You obviously value each other. You obviously value the work of Dora and Jackie enough to be here. I would invite you to um, value the food that you're about to consume and think about the land where it came from and think with gratitude with every cell in your body that food still comes from nearby. And if you really value it, work really hard because it's not gonna stick around without us working really hard and working together. None of us does this in isolation. No one is separate. You are love and you walk as love and you walk as the earth walking around as love. And thank you for valuing and loving each other. Thank you for valuing and loving this food. Thank you for valuing and loving this community. And thank you for valuing and loving the earth, our only home. Bon appétit.